Hi, this is a video on glutathione IVs. Glutathione is an antioxidant. It's found in every cell in your body. It's for your cellular walls, and it's also for chelation, and for your immune system, and a lot of other things. Uh, you'd, you could do a whole video on just glutathione itself. Uh, this video is about the IVs. <clears throat> now, as a uh, supplement, it can be given orally. It can, I, I'm pretty sure it can be rubbed on. And we tried the oral glutathione, but glutathione, like B12, is not easily absorbed by the body. We did the uh, oral B12. It was expensive and uh, like a dollar a drop, you know, so it was like a dollar a day. We absolutely saw nothing from it. And the more research I did, the more it, it became clear that you really had to go through the IV glutathione if you wanted to see any results. So that's what we did. Now, I was a little bit, you know, concerned about it because it was a more... Uh, intense intervention and you know you doing an IV that's like giving blood they have to shoot it in their arm and you have to hold it there and squeeze it in squeeze it out so it was a little bit there a lot of kids won't go for that obviously and I wasn't too sure if Jake would I didn't know what his reaction would be but he he had no problem with it actually um, I know there's a uh, message board on uh, Yahoo groups and I forget what it's called it's a chelation message board but they talk about glutathione and there's two different uh, message boards and one's pro glutathione to an extent and one's anti glutathione in the IV form and Andy Cutler I know is uh, one person who's not really for he's actually against glutathione IV and uh, I went on that message board and I asked any parents that had had any, had any bad reactions and any regression from it and no one responded I got no feedback saying that it was bad for children and yet, on the other hand, I got feedback saying that their kids benefited from it. So I went for it, and uh, we did the first uh, shot, and we were going to do them weekly. And we didn't really see anything the first week, except hyperactivity. There definitely is hyperactivity involved. And so we went back the second week, and we uh, got the shot, and then we really started to see results quickly. It was a lot like the B12. The, the, um, the uh, progress we saw was very similar to B12's progress, all in the same type areas. It didn't really necessarily make Jake more aware, although it did to an extent. And it, it wasn't as drastic an improvement as the B12 shots, not at all, but it was still clearly noticeable where we were really becoming shocked at every day. It was new things every day. So I did some filming at the time and uh, I, I put some, uh, you know, I wrote some messages in the video about what we were seeing that was new. And I'm going to show that. It's about five minutes long. And you'll get an idea just from a five-minute stretch of how, much, how many new things we were seeing daily from Jake. And, and hourly, we were seeing new things. Uh, there's been some fantastic success stories uh, with uh, glutathione IVs. Fantastic things, like kids talking for the first time you know, hours into the intervention. And I know many people will laugh at that, but these parents laughed at that and, the, and they got the glutathione IV and their kid talked within two hours. There are some miraculous stories like that. And I, I talk to parents, I personally know one and I know for a fact it is true, but that's not the norm. And uh, some people, again, will do this intervention and not see any results. So you never really know if your kid's going to see results or not. This is a more drastic form of intervention. It is definitely getting more involved with an IV. But if you've been thinking about it, if you're looking into it, and if you're interested in it, here's, you know, this is my story, what we saw with it. And here's some footage of Jake. And you'll see the kind of improvements, what kind of improvements we saw. A lot of verbal improvements uh, people report with it. And uh, the shots, each shot, I think was like 50 bucks a shot. So, I mean, you know, it was once a week. And we did eight shots. And we stopped after eight shots because uh, the last two, maybe, we didn't really see good progress. And so we stopped. I've thought about going back on occasion, but I probably am not because Jake's just, he's progressing fine by himself now. And I don't really think he's in need of any more drastic interventions. Um, a lot of times doctors will do this along with IV chelation. They'll put glutathione in and do the IV chelation at the same time. Um, I don't know. I don't know anything about that. You'd have to do your own research and ask parents about that if they feel that's safe. Uh, all I did was the glutathione IV and that's all it was. Just a glutathione IV. Um, I was doing B12 shots at the time too.
And I'm very happy we did it. We saw a lot of success with it. Um, I've done chelation and a few other interventions I did not see success with. So I don't, everything I do, I don't see success with. And this is one of the ones that I did see success. So if you're thinking about doing it, I would definitely um, recommend it. And if you're, you know, not even on the a GFCF diet yet, this is way down the line. And I would recommend B12 shots before you do glutathione. I'd recommend getting the diets in order and, you know, behavioral interventions in order before you, glutathione is a little bit more extreme. Some people may disagree with that, though. But anyway, this, that's my story. That's what I did. And here's some video footage. Take care. bite me and he and he went downstairs really fast he goes yeah and soon one day taco went near for sushi and one day <gasps> that's the winner in the playroom oh she's in the playroom yeah did you see her in there yeah oh, she said hi to you hi hi Dick. I play me <laughs> you... Dad, I want to see a picture of me. Okay, look, I can show you the picture of you. See, that's you. Mm-hmm. You can see yourself now. Look at your hand. It's all red. Hold your hand up. No, no, hold your hand up so the camera can see it. See, now the camera can see it. Mm-hmm. Is it all red? Yes. Yeah. Well, talk to the camera. Hi. Everyone's going to look at you on the computer. Hello. <laughs> What did you do yesterday? I went to the doctor's to get my blood. Yeah. And did you like it? Yeah. Who who get, uh, took the blood? Who did it? Nurse Kim. Yeah. And I got black band again. You got the black band aid, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. When are we going again? Six days. Yeah, six days. Next Monday. And then and seven days. I'm going to be out. Mama and Papa, I can't. Yeah, I love you, Daddy. Oh, I love you. <laughs> okay, Daddy, I want to go in. All right, well, say goodbye to everybody. Bye, everybody. Look at the camera and say goodbye. Goodbye. Say... All right. Yeah, time to play now. Hold up. Whoa, whoa. What? <laughs> what is it? Whoa, whoa. <laughs> because I'm going to play again now. Come on. Uh, what now? Let's go outside mm -hmm. and see okay. Russia. Okay, so I'm going to go around, where I'm going around the block. You want to go around the block? Yes. Hold on, let me get my shoes on, okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to leave you out. Dad, what is that? Um, That's a little chalkboard. Chalkboard? Can I draw on it? Yeah. I don't know where the chalk is, though. Probably out to Bob's. I will get another time. Oh, okay, get another time? Yes, when I go back to Bob's. Oh, right. And. Okay. Well, let me get my shoes on, okay? That's Trixie? No, this is Roxy and Trixie. Oh, Roxy and Trixie, oh. Yeah, they're inside. They're stuck. They're barking. I know, I hear them. Daddy, you're... Where's Big Black Dog? Where's Big Black Dog? What, Jake? Where's Big Black Dog? Where's the Rottweiler? Where's the Rottweiler? I don't know. It's oh, yeah, and it has cancer. What, the doggy has cancer? Mm -hmm. Did, you don't see the dog? He's inside. He must be inside. Yeah. Maybe it's too hot for him today. Uh, it is sweating hot! <laughs> I'm not! You're not oh, hot?